Shaker cards. You can use anything to make them, but when you have a coordinating die that will cut out the interior for you, it's a must. I stamped out this holiday wreath that comes with the coordinating dies and stencils. The stencils quickly color up every part of the wreath in three layers. There's even an extra stencil to color up the standalone images in this set as well. I decided to go in with a marker just to add a little bit more dimension, then I'll go ahead and cut out that interior piece and find the perfect piece of pattern paper to go right behind it. I also stamped and die cut the sentiment for this card. Remember to seal up that opening with acetate, pop it up on foam, and then add any type of shaker bits you want. I chose clear pieces for a subtle shaker and then you'll go ahead and close it up. To add a little something extra, I pulled out red and green bling to further decorate this wreath and now this card is ready to be sent out for the holidays.